We have here a loudspeaker, just like on your stereo set at home, and this loudspeaker is connected to a thing that makes a peculiar kind of sound. The sound is a little like the sound that would be made if I wrapped my knuckles on the wood here. Like that, that's sort of hard on the knuckles. So we have a little electric circuit that makes the same sound. You all hear that? Now that's coming out of the speaker right here. And you can see on our oscilloscope, that yellow trace up at the top, there's a little spike that goes up, and that's where the sound appears. Okay, now we're going to listen to the sound, not with our ears, but with a special microphone. Where have you seen a microphone like this? That's right, at a football game. On the sidelines at the football games, they often have these and they point them at the football players. Why do you think they do that? Why do you think? They want to try to hear maybe what plays they're calling in the huddle, maybe you think? Well, that's one theory. And, uh, but you know, I think the reason they're probably doing it is to hear the grunts and the groans and the collisions, because that sounds real good on television, right? So that's what this is, a very sensitive microphone that can pick up sounds from far away. And I'm going to use this uh, to show the speed of sound. So if I turn this on, put it over by the speaker, you can see that the sound, the yellow uh, trace there, is the sound that is being produced. And you can see the trace on the bottom is what the microphone is picking up. Now you see, first of all, that there's a little bit of delay if I stop talking. Uh, it occurs a little bit farther to, to the right, and that means later in time. You also notice that it, it doesn't look anything like that nice square pulse that's going in. And that's because there are echoes back and forth in the room, so the sound bounces around for a little while before it eventually dies out. But the interesting thing to show you is what happens if I now just back away from the speaker with the microphone. So watch. So it moves farther and farther to the right, and that means it's taking some time for the sound to travel from the speaker over to the microphone. You also notice that the little pulse is not quite so big. That means it's not so loud over here, and that makes sense. So let me come back, and you'll see it uh, uh, recover.